caring. Well, I, I didn't stop okay, caring. Why would you? Think I, 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 no, 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 no. I didn't stop caring. I didn't stop caring. <laughs> but I, I didn't play as patient because I got complacent. So your best win is now no longer. I, my. That's your best win, of course. <laughs> I need you to commentate with me. <laughs> no, it's. All right, uh, adorable knight and eternal blue, who both coming off a huge upsets. Uh, eternal blue beat oh. Regrault. Just to add to the ep upsets, yeah, eternal yeah. blue's actually been playing really well today. He beat Regrault, and then over. he beat uh, Zidico, and adorable knight beat Lou Rich. So this is, I think this might be winners semis. Our winners court is Luke versus Regrault would have been semis, right? What? It's quarters. Okay. Well, one of these. So one of these guys are guaranteed fifth. Wow. And the other and they both nine, they both deserved it. They both deserve it, though. They've, I mean, Smasher has taken out uh, he's taken out Regrol, or no? Did I say Smasher? Okay. Eternal, Eternal Blue has taken out Zydeco and, and Regrol, and then. Okay. I actually they want me to play my match. Well, they're starting. We gotta wait till after this set. We'll, um, ha we'll have time. We got time here. Yeah. All right. Game one. Okay, we got more Rosalina. Now one, we only have two Rosalinas that are really prevalent in Michigan. One of them is performing much higher than you would ever expect them to, and the other one uh, just lost to this Buster over here. Uh, so. Oh, <laughs> all right. Yeah, Eternal Blue is uh, he's normally a very like aggressive player, but he's taken he's taken some measures recently to uh, play more patient, and it's it's really showing. I have never seen Adorable Knight's Pikachu. Uh, I don't get Whoa, to see Adorable Knight. Whoa, he's Pikachu. <laughs> Often, because oh. he's a West Michigan player, this might just be a Rosalina thing. It, it has to be. Yeah. And it makes me wonder, who plays Rosalina over there? This would obviously be something that he's like he's ready for. Yeah, you know, that's true. He's, it has to be something that he deals with back at home. I mean, uh, he is Luigi. Luigi knows that he's going to lose to a good Rosalina, yeah. even, even if he doesn't. And for those of you that don't know, hand. Adorable Knight is a West Michigan player. He... As many of them out there do not come to many of our East tournaments because it is a long drive. However, this is Saturday. He does you know. really well when he does come out. Yeah, there. he he always places pretty well. Yep, he uh, got I think he got top eight at Smash Tag last time when he came out to that too. And yeah, he he beat me there too. Yeah, he's very good. He I lost to him in doubles today. Him and his brother. Uh, Pikachu obviously is a much yeah. much better matchup than Luigi. Being one of the hardest characters for Luigi, Pikachu can it just get gets, past Luma with the quick attack. It makes you wonder what is there a specific thing about Pikachu that he likes that made him choose him. I for mean, Rosa, everybody's or? got their second best character, and yeah, if, that's true. And if his happens to be Pikachu, then you know, you might as well use it when in Luigi's yeah, that makes especially sense. Especially bad matchups. But he definitely looks like he's put practice into Pikachu. He's, you know, Pikachu's a hard character to to use correctly with all the quick attacks. Very good up oh. smash by Eternal Blue. Drop shield turns around and up smashes without that, that, Luma. That hitbox is a lot bigger and a lot stronger than you think. Yeah. Eternal Blue just play it safe. Wait for Luma. Smart way to play. Ooh. Charges the forward smash. That get up attack is probably ill advised. Yeah, he was charging the forward smash before the get up attack, so he just he didn't realize it and he rolled right into it. Yeah. Or got up right into it. Adorable Knight's dancing all over the place. <laughs> you can definitely tell he put some time into this character. Yeah. It's not just pulling him out of the slumps. Eternal Blue seemed to do a good job of putting himself in the right spot to counter that quick attack, but then he, he overestimated how far he needed to reach for the grab. Tries another up smash out of shield. We jumped into that back air. Yeah. Back air is hard to avoid. It stays out for so long. It's very active. Now in a situation like that where you throw Rosa and you want to shield Luma, uh, most throws you can actually act before Luma can. So what you want to do is throw out a hitbox that will hit Luma away and just deal more damage to her and possibly kill her. Right. There are right. Ooh. And Adorable Knight is taking the lead. Not by much, though. Not a huge lead, but these are two very light characters, so 20% is yeah. All right, Eternal Blue's a bigger gonna deal than normal. He's going to use this platform to make his way back to the stage. Doesn't want to get stuck on the ledge again. You want to stay in the middle if you're Rosa, so that if your Luma gets hit, it doesn't just die in one 
tap. Exactly. That's a good down tilt. Rosalina also has one of the more exploitable recoveries in Smash 4. So being off stage is ne not really a good thing. Exploitable as in you like to watch him up be under the stage now? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is pretty intense. Adorable Knight hasn't gotten hit since it was tied. Or since it was even, at least. Now he's got a good 40% lead. But being Pikachu, either one of these guys could die in the next hit. Pikachu has a hard time killing. Uh, Rosalina has a hard time surviving. And Adorable Knight seems to just be throwing off his up smashes. I'm not sure. He doesn't seem to be trying for any other type of kill setups. Besides just the raw up smash. You might need to work a little harder than that. Eternal Blue is a decent piece. He's a good enough player not to just get hit by neutral smashes, you know? Oh my gosh. Again, runs up and gets yeah, down tilted. I, he's getting a little. And he's anxious. He's, he's getting a little smashes. anxious here, yeah. It's gonna cost him. Yeah. Ooh, clever. Yeah. That's that Pikachu main stuff. <laughs> Coming from a Pikachu secondary. Yeah. Like I said, Dormal Knight's a good player. He'll all right, the Eternal Blue special. Yeah. Eternal Blue proving to be very difficult to finish off. Now Pikachu's back throw is not a kill throw. Even if you're one of the lightest characters at 130%. But either way, it sends him off stage and it puts Pikachu back in this advantageous position well, yeah. where obviously, Eternal Blue has to find a way back. Yeah, obviously he wanted to do the back throw. He's just not going to kill. It might at this point. But I like... Oh! Ooh! Sneaks under the the Thunder Jolt. I like that he was opting to just power shield the Thunder Jolts as opposed to, you know, throw out down because the down is is slow and if you go yeah. for it, you get hit for it. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, from far away I'll throw a Hadoken at Rosalina just the, to bait the down B because I can you act just run up and do can. something, yeah, yeah. I act before them. But no, he was like, I'm just gonna let you keep doing that on the platform and then kill you for it. Yep. And when you Eternal have Blue, I don't think has ever used any character besides Rosalina, so he knows he knows what is and isn't safe. Yeah. <laughs> when you have a character that can punish other characters' uh, projectiles, that is definitely something you want to implement. So if Eternal Blue takes this, he is in winter semis. That is insane. And what a day! <laughs> Meanwhile, I gotta beat Smasher not to get third. Wait, I think I went. I think I play the winner of this then. Oh, shut up. No, maybe not. <laughs> Gucci says no. All right. They're both the spacing. <laughs> you yes. play K-Sed. <laughs> okay, I've, so I've actually been wanting that for a while. But back to walks this match. Up and shields the forward smash, but it did kill Luma. And you try to catch him on the two frame. Actually, yeah. pretty. You try to just catch him during his quick attack. Pikachu's yeah, 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 hurt yeah. box is enormous during that move. Because it stretches him out. And the whole thing. It's easy to catch uh, teleport characters and, su and such like that. Yep. They just stand back. This is how they started. The good, very. Neither one of them wanting to overcommit. And now he's opting to uh, jump over them so he can protect Luma. Smart. If your shield's not in the right position, Luma, Luma will still get hit by it. Yeah. Luma took that forward air like a champ, but he couldn't land on the stage. He really needs to DI that. He really needs to DI that in he, either direction. He didn't DI the throw, which was a mistake, but at least he DI'd the, the hit yeah, of yeah. Thunder so that he survived. Oops, I'm kicking the light. That's my mistake. Oh, he, oh, he DI'd it enough. So both, both of them still have two stacks. Eternal Blue just goes right up onto the stage. Made it look like he was going to grab the edge, so it was a pretty yeah. smart recovery. Definitely, uh, it made a Durable Knight have to react quick in order to get the up smash to punish it. Yep. Durable Knight, by the way, Ooh. I'm just now realizing, stuck with... Still not trying his main, even though he lost the first game. So he's, he's got confidence. He's confident, yeah. yeah. And I mean, I, I could see him taking it. Yep. Him and his brother both have more than one character. I have to spend a lot of time. There it is. Just the, raw, dash the raw dash attack. Runs right up and takes the stack. It's a good forward air. Off the ledge. Oh, messes both up the quick attack. Sparks. Hits him with both hits of the forward smash. Eternal Blue with the unnecessary taunt. <laughs> In my opinion. 
Hey, if it gets in their head. Uh, yeah, more power to you. Uh, just war flashbacks to Amiibo King. <laughs> doing the four taunts. He did win. <laughs> That's a good grab. That's a very good grab. Quick reaction to Eternal Blue Shield. Rosalina was one of the most deceiving dash attacks. The range on her dash attack, even oh, yeah. without Luma, is so good. And with Luma, it's just. And it's, it's such a versatile move, too. Yeah, it really is. It's 42 28. This is a very close game. Not 40 to 42 is basically dead even. Uh, yeah, he's just catching his retreats with that. The two top tier characters, two very light characters. There's basically there's no favorite at this point. Another dash tag, which maybe isn't a great option, but it is good for hitting Luma. Luma hits him in the back while he's trying to forward air. Got to be aware that Luma is unfair as that might seem. It's a good thunder. Eternal, um, Adorable Knight did what he's supposed to do and just let the smashes come out. Yep. Just go around them. Adorable Knight's doing a good job of just... Uh, putting himself, he's not like run, he's like walking and doing neutral getups. He's very careful about where he stands in regards to where the hitboxes are. Okay, so normal knight with a small advantage right now, uh, can definitely kill at this point. Rosalina can kill at just about any point, but uh, up air would do it right here for him. Turtle Blue doing a lot of star bits this set. It's a good, uh, it's a good poking move. You it's know, if the other player thinks they're standing right outside of your range with yeah. Luma, you throw that out, and it it makes them second think things. Yeah, like Dorman that wants to just run up and roll or run up and spot dodge and stuff by the starbits a couple times. Oh, they're both playing so safe. Oh, Luma tried to punch Pikachu right now. Kiss her. All right, now he's going for the downbees. He's doing it at a safe enough distance though, to where Pikachu can't. Get anything off yeah, of now it. that he's a little closer, he's kind of smacking him. That's another thing you can do. Yep. Uh, might be the most optimal way to deal with them. I mean, Power Shield is probably Ooh. a little better, but... Got, I think I was caught off guard by the extended hitbox there. Rosalina is able to survive that. Luma, not so fortunate. Um, Eternal Blue is predicting the thunder. That's why he went for the down B out there. Yeah, I mean, it's safer than air dodging. Yeah. It covers a lot more time. But it, he there doesn't it get a punish off of it. And Eternal Blue is in winner semifinals against who? If you and Case are on one side, it's going to be Eternal Blue. Uh, Dakota. Low Can one. We see the other side of the bracket? It's low one. It's